And f okay, here we go. Here we go. Ladies and gentlemen, due to circumstances beyond our control, we have started this Isaiah takeover. A good three, four, maybe five hours late. Let me tell you. All right. Let me just get into what's going on. And I may be giving some spoilers away, but that's just how it goes. Because you know what matters? You guys. And I have to tell you, you know, we're on location today. I'm in the trailer. And when you're on location, you can't take pictures of everything, even though you'd like to. Because then you're giving them away and stuff. But you know me, I, I took some pictures. Some pictures maybe I shouldn't have taken. Some pictures maybe I wouldn't have taken. Some pictures maybe I couldn't have taken. That makes no sense. Oh, am I upside down? Oh, my right side up again. Oh my goodness. Okay, so. Uh, now that I'm back from the upside down, blah, blah, blah. Um, I can finish telling you what I was telling you. So anyway, uh, we are on location today. And I am um, at lunch right now, currently. Uh, so I couldn't take pictures. I mean, I was working with Alberto. Uh, we had a whole little thing planned, but we couldn't really get into it because then we would give away spoilers. And we tried. Believe me, we tried. Actually, there are, were a couple videos and pictures that we took, but we had to take them, like, kind of not around stuff. And so... It, it just kind of oh, okay. Well, look at that. No, oh, now now we're good. So I had to take them for in uh, you know nondescript kind of like this. Like oh, where am I? I'm in a trailer. Um, sorry, but check it out though. I'm gonna tell you what's going on because I'm just breaking all the rules today. All right. So here we go. Where were we? All right. Now, as you know, with my previous takeovers, I can't just give you the information. I have to give you some hints, and maybe you'll guess, you know, what's going on. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go ahead and uh, give you the hints, and then I'll look down at the, the, the little, you know, responding, and I will get back to you and let you know if you're getting close, if you're getting warmer. Ooh, shall we play that game? Warmer, colder? And maybe you guys can punch in, like, a fire sign, or I can do that, or, or a snowflake sign. Who knows? But anyway, here we go. So... Today, Simon and Luke, they're together, okay? That's the first thing. They're looking for something, okay? This thing that they're looking for is extremely important. Is it A, an animal, meaning human, mammal, wolf, the undead, shadow being, any one of those. Is it B, a piece of fruit, banana, apple, orange, grapes, strawberries, cherries, blueberries? Or is it an inanimate object such as a desk, a chair, an instrument? Wink, wink, you know what I'm talking about. Uh, what is it? I'll tell you what, it's one of those three things. And it holds great power. I think I'm okay telling you that. All right. Also, guess who else was on set today? Sorry, I, I, my, I was chewing back the uh, the uh, mixed nuts and berries I was eating earlier. Guess who else was on set today? None other than Alicia. That's right. And she was with someone else today. But I cannot say who. Not saying that you've met them or you haven't met them, but I cannot say who, because that person will give away the first question. So there, that's a clue. If you can figure out who she may be with that would give away the first question, I mean, you're on to it. You're like Sherlock Holmes out there. Also, there's a little something that uh, that happened earlier today, and you'll be getting a video that, that kind of shows what's going on, but I was in this trailer, this very trailer, and um, minding my business, making a video for you guys, and suddenly I 
walked in and sat next to myself. How rude, right? Interrupted my whole thing. No, no, you heard it right. I interrupted my own video by walking in, sitting down, and trying to take over my takeover. It was crazy. So I had to do something, and I'm not proud of what I did, but um, I kind of locked myself away someplace, but apparently I got out. So there's another one of me running around set today, and we're, we're going to find out. After lunch, I'm going to go check it out. I'm going to see if I can find myself. Um, and not in the you know spiritual sort of way, but in, in reality, like like there's an alternate me running around, and I don't even know like who, who knows is he nice, is he is he mean, is he friendly, is he handsome? We don't know. I just caught a glimpse of, glimpse of him, but he's out there, and 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 who knows what he's up to. <sighs> anyway, um, let's get to some questions. Let's see what everybody's doing, what everybody's talking about. Here we go. All right. Um, all right. Uh, uh, let's go Emily Thorpe. Like a Magnus Harry thing? Hmm. Uh, I wouldn't say that, but close. Uh, let's go to Blossom uh, Morrison. Hey, man. Hey. Hey. How are you? All right. You're good. Good. Ooh. Jessica Gillis says, were you looking for Lilith? Who's that? I don't know who that is. I don't know. I know who that is in the books. Don't know who it is here. Possibly. Anyway, uh, moving on. Claudia Griffith says, I hope it's B. <laughs> Apples and bananas. But it's probably a wolf. Well, I'll tell you what. I'll narrow it down for you. It's not apples. Well, actually, maybe. It's not bananas. Although, what we were doing was bananas. So technically, it was bananas. Dad Joe coming at you at 100 miles an hour. Watch out now. You might get hit. Um, and is it a wolf? I can guarantee you it was not a wolf. Okay. Um, Who did I work with today? Uh, as I said, I worked with Alberto. Um, uh, Brie Rose. Uh, I worked with Alberto and... Alicia was there, but I did not work with her technically, and there was also uh, someone who I have worked with before, but I I cannot reveal. All right, um, Nika McNeil says, "Who is the new warlock dude in season three? Man, can I give that away? Man, there is someone here who is literally holding." the soul sword and has promised to zap me with it if I tell okay I won't say if I say anything I'm gonna get zapped with the soul sword love lives who stays together and who breaks up now break up is a, is a very harsh uh, we like to say moving on in the shadow world you know um, all right whoa Lynn Del Monte, I'm writing a book at the cross between Shadow Hunters and Supernet. Oh, I'm losing it. Hold on. The circus got. Oh, it sounded good, though. Man. All right, uh, Laura Mason. Uh, hey, uh, you're from Scotland. Well, listen, how are you doing out there? How's it going? Standalone episodes. I like that idea. I do like that idea. That's interesting. Um, uh, little standalone episodes. So you get more of the character, right? I agree. That, that'd be kind of fun. Yeah, you know, but we all like playing, though, you know what I mean? So everybody wants to get in there and kind of have fun together. We're a big, happy family. I mean, you guys know that. We, you see what's going on. You see the pranks that are pulled all the time. You know, you see the, the, the running around, the, uh, chasing people, tying people up, whatnot. You know, all the fun stuff. The family stuff. Um, let's see here. Uh, Amanda Tyler Corb says, a Valentine. My guess is Valentine has a son. Well, listen, Alan is not here. Uh, if he was here, though, you could guarantee that he would definitely have the soul sword pressed against my neck. Because I, his former parabatai, have um, antagonized him so much that every time he sees me, he just he, he has it out for me. 
he offered, he actually invited me to go play hockey, and I said no because I knew that when I stepped on the ice, the first thing he would do is, like, you know, slew foot me or, or trip me or push me into the boards or something mean. You know what I mean? It's, it's, it's a Valentine thing. You know, you, you kind of don't, you don't even get upset about it after a while. You just, you just go like, yeah, okay, it's Valentine. He's doing his thing, whatever. Um, all right, Carla, you guys need to do some episodes from one POV. I, I hear you. I hear you. And I'm sure everyone else hears you too. Whoever's watching this, the brass that's watching this video, I'm sure they hear you too. I mean, we need to get this viewership way over what it is right now, by the way. Um, look here, I, I promise this, okay? And I might get in trouble for this. But I don't care, because I'm, I'm, it's, because it's, it's Tuesday, and you know what that means. I'm giving out secrets. If we can get the viewership of this video up to fifteen hundred people, I'll give away some serious dirt. Serious dirt. No joke. No clues. No tongue twisters. No riddles. But just serious. And I'm only supposed to be on there fifteen minutes, but I will, st I will stay around to try to get the viewership up. I'll stick around for you because I believe that we can do it and I believe the information that I am holding will not only get me fired but will make you so so happy. Okay, who's next? Um, Samantha Velez. Samantha! How are you? How are you doing? I feel like I've answered one of your questions before. How would I describe Luke's storyline in season three? Ooh, good question. Um, well, you know Ollie and what she's up to. You know what happened at the end of season two, what she's asking about. Well, let's just say that his storyline revolves around that, and that takes him deeper into the shadow world than he's ever been because he's trying to hide so many things. He's got to find a way to keep these secrets, and the best way to do that, into the shadows. So anyway, um, Deborah Reyes, uh, do, do I miss Jocelyn? Every single day. Could we all have a moment of silence for Jocelyn, please? Let's just take one second and remember Maxime Gua, the lovely and talented. Our hearts go out to you. We miss you dearly. But as in all science, fiction, supernatural genre shows. You may be dead, but you are not gone. You never know. You never know. I don't know. Um, let's see. What else? Uh, who else here? Kyle Chapman. Luke butting heads with anybody in this season? Big fight scene coming up. Big fight scene coming up. Like, it's gonna be, dare I say, humdinger. Look that word up. I don't even know what it means. Anyway, um, let's see, uh, Katie Page, I love you so much, oh, I love you too, I'm your favorite wolf in the pack. Listen, you just touched me right now, could I get a tissue please, something, it's... I like being the favorite. Thank you. Oh, oh. Oh. Anyway, next, um, I would be remiss if I didn't give a tiny shout out to those lovely, lovely rats that keep me up at night with their DMs because they just keep coming and coming and coming. Like, they never stop. Like, they just keep sending personal messages, just keep going, keep going. You guys love sending them. And for that reason, I love you. So there, that's my rat shout out. Nay, Yera, the, the crew, Anissa, all of you guys, you know. I love you all. I love you all. I love you all. And if I forgot somebody's name, I know I'm going to hear it. I know I'm going to hear it. I know you're going to give me all kinds of flack, but I'm ready. I'm ready. And by the way, when those special gifts get to you guys that I sent you all, please make sure you stay warm in those. Anyway, moving on. Uh, your voice is so lovely, very soothing. I often put myself to sleep talking to myself. Speaking of myself, again, I will let you guys know earlier, like I said earlier, there's another me 
running around the set and I'm gonna find him I'm gonna find you if you're out there I bet he's watching me right now on this live yeah look it went from 827 to 828 oh 834 maybe he's multiplying I don't know but I'm gonna find you man and when I find you I'm gonna get you uh, McKinsey, how many compliments do we need for some serious dirt? It's not about compliments. It's the viewership. If we can get it up to 1,500. I mean, I have... Oh, my gosh. I have this information that I have to give you. It is so, so good. So good. I, I'm risking my life. Not really, but I'm risking my job by telling you this. And I don't mind, because you need to know. You need to know. I'd want to know. It's so good. It's so good. And I'm serious, too. In all seriousness, sorry, I saw something pop up. In all seriousness, it is good information. It's the kind of information that would, like, this kind of information, like, oh, 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 my, oh, girl, oh, my, oh, girl. You better sit down, girl. I got to tell you something. That's the kind of information that I'm talking about. Not just, oh, by the way, no, not that kind of information. I'm talking about, he did what? They're going to do what? He shot who? Oh, he lost what? She did that? She punched who? It's crazy. It's crazy. <sighs> All right. Now, technically, my time is up, but I'm not getting off this here live chat. I'm sticking around because I am with my peoples. And I need to give you some more information. But I just need the viewership to go up. We need to raise the roof. Raise the roof. Raise the... Okay. Okay. It just went down. Seriously? Seriously. All right, what can I tease you? What can I give you that'll that'll help you to get higher viewers? Um, let's see, what can I say? Oh, uh. okay. I have to give a, I have to give a hint because I can't just give out information, but I can give a hint. Okay, of the uh, out of Jace, Isabel, Alec, and Clary. Okay. Out of those four, one of them goes through a pretty interesting, and that's all I'm going to say. I can't say any more because there's someone here with a soul sword, and quite frankly, I don't want to get cut, so I'm not going to say anything else. You can put the sword down. I didn't say what you didn't want me to say, but I could say it. Oh, I'm getting chastised right now. All right, let's go back. Uh, Philippine Ponsar, uh, police headquarters. Oh, yeah, you'll get to see a little bit of the police headquarters this season. Um, you saw a little bit of my desk when I shared the one picture, but you will get to see a little bit of the, uh, you know, the whole, the whole deal. Um, how do I say my, how do you say my last name, Teresa? It's Mustafa or Mustafa. Really, it's up to you. However you found, uh, feel like, like saying it, you know, I mean, just sound it out and go, go for it, go for what you know, you won't offend me, I'm good, I'm good. It's too late for some people, I know, but you know what, honestly, think about this, what if like, you just like, woke up and you're like, you know what, oh my god, I need my Shadow Hunters fixed, let me see what's on live, oh my gosh, it's live right now, boom, you just woke up, had an amazing gift, you might even think it's a dream when you wake up, but it's not it's real it's real and you guys are real and I want to give you some real dirt but there's a real knife being pointed at me so I, <laughs> I can't do that right now sorry sword soul sword anyway um, the soul sword doesn't have power on a wolf well 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 maybe I will tell you then huh <laughs> would I ever consider directing an episode if I, if you knew how many times I have been asking 
our beloved leader and executive producer Matt Hastings whom we all love so dearly because he could grant that wish I have asked him so many times may I please perhaps would you perhaps please grant me this one wish and I'm doing my work on the other end so that maybe that could happen so we'll see maybe next year we'll see Luke and Cat, Luke Cat, Isaiah, please, Nay is begging. <sighs> if you don't think I have heard Nay, I just told a story about Nay in New York begging that same question. So, you know, hey, I, I can only do so much. You know what I'm saying? Um, you needed my your fan, uh, Shadow Hunters fix. I know, I know. Me, oof, man. Let's talk about something cool. What can I do? Who has any suggestions? All right. Meme Monday was last year, last season. We did Meme Monday, and, and we did a pretty good job. We had the Meme Marathon, and we had fun, you know. Everybody was getting into it. Um, what can we do this season that, like right now, starting, let's say starting December. No, 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 let's start now. The Let's starting right before Thanksgiving. What can we do that's kind of fun and interesting and cool that'll keep you guys engaged? Not that you're not, but that'll keep you into it, having fun, ask, ask, asking questions, answering questions, posting videos, videos. Ah, ah, oh. It's like it just came to me. Like it just like, Whoa. I got it. I got it gifts that's right gifts what if we do like a gift day where we all post like interesting gifts but there had they have to be shadow hunter related um preferably downworld but shadow hunter related gifts that i don't know they, they just have to be engaging you know what i mean and fun nothing gross or perverse I know some of you, you know who you are, like to get a little crazy with the postings. Let's keep it all PG, okay? Um, there's some kids out there. But what if we made gifts on a specific day? Maybe uh, we did Mondays last time, so maybe we do it on, ooh, maybe we do it on hump day, Wednesday. Wednesday we make gifts. Maybe we do that. Who's in? Anybody? Anybody? I'm, I'm, I'm waiting. I need answers from all of you. Come on. Come on. Oh, I love it. A Angela's like, Isaiah, we do that every day. Yes, Angela, you do that every day. But I, I do not. And maybe I could do something special for you every Wednesday. Something fun. I need to get engaged. I I I, I want to. You know what I mean? Like I need to. Like this season's been rough. You know what I mean? It's been very very intense because what when you guys see episode one of season three, everything will fall into place. You will understand why it has been so crazy. Because I saw a clip today. No joke. On on Matt Hastings' phone, he showed a clip of. Oh man, I can't. Anyway. I saw it it literally made the hair on my neck stand up and not because it was like oh this is cool look shadow hunters is back no because it was absolutely horrifying it was so scary and so like just like visceral and real and like like electric yeah, I mean like this season's gonna be something else. It's it's like we, we, they have raised the bar on everything: production level, fights. I mean, I mean, ooh, and and talk about a writer's room to be envious of. I mean, they are crushing episodes. You don't even know. You don't even know, but you will know. Trust me on that. It's so, so good. Like I saw some stuff that, like everybody that was standing around, we were all standing there, and he was showing um, the director of this episode. He showed him, and everybody was just like, "Oh, hey, did you see that? Oh my god!" 
It was crazy. It was crazy. I'm still like, you can see I'm I'm I don't even know. What, whew, I was sweating. Like it got it got hot. It was like it was like getting some some tapatio and then some habanero. Sweat was just whoo whoo. You know what I mean? It was crazy. And he likes to tease us with little information like that too. Oh, blooper reel. Blo okay, I got you. I got you. I got you. I got you. I love bloopers. All right, but it's it's hard because you can't really make a blooper it just has to happen um but i love them but knowing that you guys love them i think it makes mistakes a little easier to make <laughs> just have to be mindful of time because you know we want to get our episodes out to you guys on, at a, in a timely manner so we can't mess around too much but we do love having fun thus getting everybody in a room together somebody's cracking up it's probably gonna be dumb i ain't gonna lie the boy loves to laugh. You can make him laugh. All you got to do is go like this. Boo. And he is on the floor. Trust me. Trust me. He's always laughing at something. Cat too. Cat too. I know. I know. She tries to be all like, no, no, no. I'm I'm sweet and, and awesome. And no. She laughs all the time. She's silly. She likes being silly. I'm just telling you. I've seen it. I've seen it. Believe me. You know what she loves to do? Let me tell you, sometimes I come in here, you know, mind my own business, get ready for work. I'm coming in. All of a sudden, I look down on my desk. What's over there? Some. Now, she knows I don't eat sugar. She knows this. But she also knows that I can't help myself. I have a sweet tooth. I love ginger chews. I love them. I love them. Sometimes she'll just leave a package of them on my desk. With a little sweet note that says, oh, thanks for being such a cool, like, wolf dad. You know, you're awesome. And I'm like, oh, man, you could have just left the note. You didn't have to leave the pack of ginger chews. And you know what happens? I go through all of them. I eat them all. Proudly. I eat them all. And it's her fault. And I will have no more of it, cat. You hear me? I know you're out there. I know you're watching. I don't want any more of your candy, cookies, sweets, none of it. None of it. None of it. None. Okay, sorry, I had to get that out because it's real. It's real. My my sweet tooth is so, so real. Okay, anyway. Um, <clears throat> who's next? Can we send you 500... Okay, see? This is what I'm saying. Now you guys want to send Ginger Chews, please. Ginger's supposed to calm the tummy. My tummy's been calm for years now because I've got calm tummy in the bank because of all the Ginger Chews I've eaten. Please, we don't need to. We don't need to send anymore. No, Kyle, cat's so sweet and innocent. She, she's anybody who makes sweets and chocolate cakes and gives them to you when they know that you don't want them. That's not sweet. That's like maniacal. You gotta watch out for the girl. Watch out. A cake is coming near you soon, Kyle. Okay, I'm gonna stop because I'm getting hungry and I don't wanna eat something. Glenette Brown says, if you have a sweet tooth, why are your teeth perfect? Glenette, girl. Thank you. They're not perfect. Um, I actually chipped my tooth back here um, and it's still chipped, but I haven't been home, so I haven't been able to fix it, but it hurts. And you know, like you chip your tooth and then you like put your tongue on it and then it kind of scratches your tongue every day, every day. These are real problems. These are real werewolf problems. I bet y'all didn't even know that, huh? Werewolf chip teeth. It happens. Everybody does it. Um, Becca Styles, Teaser Tuesdays, you know, I really want to tell you my stuff, but I don't want to get hurt. <laughs> I want. I have, I have so much to tell you. Oh, it's it's not, it's not fair. It's not fair. Oh, ooh. I just figured something out. I can't tell you, but the other me, 
the other Isaiah, the alternate universe Isaiah, the one that's running around out there, if he gets a hold of somebody's Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, he can tell you, and I'm off the hook. See how I did that? It's all coming full circle. You didn't know what I was doing, but now you figured it out because I, I put in a fail safe, an information fail safe. Why? Because I love you. You know. Come on. You know. Who's not smiling out there? I, I see you. You're not smiling. You need to put the... Yes. Thank you very much. Thank you. Smile. Very, very good. Very. Um, try braces. Braces? Oh, you saying I need braces on my teeth. Okay. Electra Heart. I had braces, all right? It's not the braces. It's a, it's a chip. How did I get it? I can't tell. Okay, I'll tell you. It's silly, though. I was eating an almond. Simple as that. Chip my tooth. Two Isaiahs is the dream. Um, not to the original. Okay? The fake Isaiah out there, who looks just like this, is out there. Okay? Please tell the world that cheesecake is the superior cake. Now, listen, Sarah. I'm glad you brought this up. Cheesecake, um, it was my favorite. And I used to get confused. I'm not going to lie to you. I was confused for a long time. I, I thought that cream cheese pie was the same thing as cheesecake. But it's not. They're two separate things. Which really messed me up because I thought I was in love with cheesecake when I was younger. But then the cream cheese pie, you know. So now I'm on a quest um, to find a combination of the two because I think that's really where it's at. That's really where it's at. Cream cheese cheesecake. You gotta say cheese twice because there's twice the cheese. Cream cheese cheesecake. All right? Oh, dang it! I've given Cat ammunition. Why did you get me talking about desserts? You know she's going to send this to me. I need a moment. No! Oh, okay. Okay, I'm back. Oh, I know there's going to be a cake in my dressing room tomorrow. I know it. I know it. And Sarah, it's your fault. Ah, it's been half an hour now. Shall I get off or shall we keep talking? Shall we keep going? A little more? Till they call me back to set? <laughs> uh, you should check out... Mm -hmm. Who lost their teeth? I will make you a combination of ice cream cheesecake and mail it to you in the freezer. In a freezer? You're going to mail it in a freezer? That's expensive. Yeah, that, that's really expensive. There's all kinds of shipping costs. You're gonna, why don't you just give Kat the recipe? No, no don't do that, because you'll do it. Um, let's see. Ran yes. <laughs> Kat's bullying me with desserts. She's the dessert bully. <laughs> Poor thing. She, she's in the kitchen cooking right now. She's like, I'm not a bully. <laughs> um, do a room tour. Listen, I'm going to tell you. You want to see the room tour? Here's the room. There's my stuff. I don't know if our soul sword holder <laughs> wants to be noticed right now. But I'll give a... Uh, yeah, there you go. That's the room. Have I seen Stranger Things? I, there's some things we shouldn't talk about on this Shadow Hunters live chat. But yes. Um, anyway. Um, Cat, try making some sugar... Yes! Sugar free. No. See, I don't think it's so much the sugar that I'm upset with. It's the fact that I just eat it all. It's not like I'm. I'm. I don't save it. Or savor it. I just eat it. It's like I, I can't. Like I have to. You know, I it just. It's. It's the wolf in me. I don't know. Yeah, it gets all over my face. And people look at me. They're like, Are you five? Like, clean your mouth off, boy. It happens all the time. I can't help myself. Sweets. Uh, Ashley, what are your favorite, funniest bloopers, memories from Shadow? Um, anything in the Jade Wolf. 
I'm telling you, that place is, it's, it's infected with laugh devils. It's true. You go into the Jade Wolf, you just start laughing. You can't help it. Uh, are you sick? I hope not. You work so hard. No, I'm not sick. I'm good. If my if I if I'm like nasally, it's because I was just crying, thinking about all the desserts I'm going to eat later. Um, is Garrow Bane going to an alternate universe? Katie Davis Jackson, you crack the code. Not quite. Close, but not quite. Um, let's see what else. What's wrong with that? Nothing. I get it. I I know you're. I know. I know. I know. I'm a bit, I I know. Um, Angelica, who? Oh, who? the best cast member to work with alright I'm gonna blow the lid off this one and I know it's gonna get me some probably some some hate bakings <laughs> or something in my trailer but I will let you know who the best person is to work with in just a moment <laughs> not right now um, I can't say I come on now Luke has not had any interactions with him yet, but Luke loves little Max. Um, yes, I know. Yera, go to sleep. It's past your bedtime. But anyway, uh, Nicole Jacobs. Hey, South Africa! You stayed up past two for us? And it's your birthday? Ready? Here we go. Happy birthday to you. Hey. Happy birthday to you, hey, happy birthday to you down in South Africa, hey, happy birthday to you. I don't do that for many people, but I did it for you, because you know where you live? right here right in my heart yes there's a nice little condominium uh, community in there that fits all of you guys it's fun in there it's a fun heart to live in because it's a wolf heart hey all right I'm just biting I'm just like soaking up all the time because I don't really want to get off this chat because I'm trying to get the viewership up because I really have secrets to tell that I just want to tell everybody it's just the way it goes I don't know I'm so oh like I am I'm the worst with information like this when it comes to like this kind of information I just want to tell people maybe if you stepped outside for a moment maybe then maybe I could be like oh <laughs> oh she's going outside okay okay here it is this information is about Magnus Bane no oh, I know you like Magnus Bane information. Now this is real, okay? This is real. Magnus Bane. There's been a whole new little situation created in his lair. Let's just say that. And in that situation, there's all kinds of new and crazy items. And I took a video of it. And someone stopped me right when I was taking a video and I'm gonna post that video tonight on this late takeover <laughs> oh what should we do you guys let's do <laughs> let's do something we're hanging out man we're we're sitting here in the trailer just hanging out what's happening yeah we're doing it man we're do ooh. you know what this is this is episode 308, the one that we're currently working on right now. I could flip this bad boy over, and we could all see the title. And then you would no longer have a werewolf to love next year. So I won't do that. I won't do that. But I want to. I really do. I just want to give up all the secrets. I guess I'd be a good uh, hostage because I, uh, I wouldn't get unless you gave me like cheesecake, and then I'm just like, blah, 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 blah. here's all the information, done, right? Let's eat chocolate cake. Now, 
I know there's a lot of you who are probably chocolate fans out there, but I'm going to be honest with you. I'm not. I'm not really into chocolate cake. I do like chocolate. I like a dark chocolate, like 70% cocoa. You know, like a good, like bitter, a little bit bitter. Um, milk chocolate. I'm not. I'm not a fan. It's okay. Milk chocolate on raisins. Now that's what I like. I'll do that. I'll do that. But I just like if it's just a bar of milk chocolate, I'm not in. I'm not. I, I want the dark chocolate. You know what I'm saying? Because dark chocolate, you can put it with like all kinds of stuff, and it just it's still good. It's like, it's bitter, but it's good. You know what I mean? It's bitter, but it's good. Sort of like Imogen. She's bitter, but she's good. <laughs> all right. Thank you. Please ba be back next year. Oh yes. Any Luke Magnus scenes? Yes. There's a couple. That friendship is definitely being explored, and that I can definitely tell you. Um, there's some quality Luke Magnus, scene, Magnus scenes. Um, some really good stuff. Um, that I'm very happy to say that I can say without getting stabbed uh, by the Soul Sword. So I can tell you that. Um, let's see what else. Um, do I have a holiday wish list? Why, yes, I do. I want a camera, a new camera, because as, as you know, I love taking pictures. Um, and maybe a lens to go along with it, um, and maybe some ginger chews. Oh, did I say that? <laughs> My bad. <laughs> uh, anyway, uh, let's see, who else? Uh, Michelle, give me your location and I will send all the cheesecake. Oh, that sounds, oh, please don't tempt me with that. I just love eating cake. Can you stop to be perfect for just one minute? I, you mean I'm not being perfect right now? I know I have faults and flaws, and eating cheesecake is one of them. Deanna, you want to give me some ginger chews? Because you want all the information. See, Deanna said, I'll give you ginger chews and you spill your guts. See how it is? I see, like you guys, seriously. I give you my secrets and you turn them against me. Peanut butter ginger chews, by the way. Those are the real ones that I really like. Those are the ones that taste the best. So if you're going to do it, go big. Um, let's see what else. Dark chocolate all the way. Yes. Um, talk about your photography. Uh, I would, but it's not so much Shadowhunter related. But I will do this. How about... Oh! Ah, okay. So how about this? I got it. What if I take a photograph, just a, just a headshot photograph, of each of uh, you know the main characters in shadow hunters and then i post them how about that and let's see if i do it right maybe if i do it right like one a week then i can we can i don't know get to april 3rd maybe let's see i'd have to start in like january okay i'll start in january okay so 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 somebody whoever the scribe is whoever is uh the minute taker of the Facebook Live, take the minutes down. Um, uh, for the record, let, let let the record reflect that I will take a photograph of each character, just a headshot. I'll doctor it up, make it all nice, and I will post it starting in January. Give me a little time, hopefully, to get that new camera. Wink, wink. Um, that was for my uh, family out there, my real family, my family that, like, the family, the little one, my daughter. Because I know you got money, kiddo. I know you've been hoarding some cash since you've been two. You need to put that cash on a camera and buy your dad a camera. All right, enough. Anyway, I will use that money on a camera, and I will take a picture of each of the uh, leads, and probably some other characters, too, because let's be real, there's more weeks than we have characters. So, um, and I'll post it once a week. How about that? That sounds good, right? Maybe I'll make that into a gift, too. You know? Oh. Okay. I've been told that I can talk about the photography page. Alright. It's just a habit. It's a habit that's turned into to a hobby that's turned into a love. I just love doing it. I like taking pictures. I love perspective. I love composition. I want to be a director. So I just want to learn frame sizes and everything that has to do with, with cameras. So that's, that's what I'm into. My favorite thing to take pictures of. Honestly... I'm well. It changes, but right now, I just got out of like my building phase where I was really into taking buildings and landscapes. I did that a lot, but right now, I'm, I just got into taking pictures of people. You know what I mean? 
people. Um, I just like, I like, you know, but not like posy pictures, but just kind of like random, like street photography, that kind of, because I just love to see people and, you know, doing their thing. Um, what else? Uh, which hockey players would make the best shot? Uh, let me just tell you who the best shadow hunters and downworlders of the hockey world would be. All right. And I think, you know, the L.A. Kings. Come on now. The night, there, excuse me, the 2012-2014 Stanley Cup Championship L.A. Kings. Anyway, uh, moving on. Um, Katie Stewart, are you going to post more? Yeah, um, yeah, like this whole month was rough because as I told some of you, um, I've been having some things go on, you know, personally in the family. So I've had to go back home and kind of take care and take a look and, and make sure my family's been cool and everything. So it's kind of cut into my, like, recreational time. Uh, so I wasn't able to, to really, like, uh, devote a lot of time to social like I normally do. This whole season's been a little rough. But, as you know, I have not forgetting, forgotten about you, and I will get some things out to you. Trust me. Um, I'll get a lot more out to you. So, because I feel like I'm behind. And when I feel like I'm behind, I feel like I let you down. So now that I feel like I'm behind and let you down, I need to boost you up. How many of you would be like, if I was your dad, you'd be like, Daddy, stop it, please. Please, you're embarrassing me. I know. My, dad, my daughter says it all the time. She's like, Dad, no. <laughs> but that's like fuel to fathers. When you tell them no, they just go like, oh, I'll keep it going. <laughs> anyway. All right. Um, call the gift Wednesdays. Gara Wednesday. What? Gara Wednesdays. Ooh, if somebody has a better name than that, please say it. Gara Wednesdays is pretty good. That's pretty good. We need to write that down. Can you put your sword down and write that down? <laughs> oh, we've laughed. We've cried. We've talked about sweets and given you that much teaser information. And it's not my fault. Anissa, you're back. Hey, what's happening? Oh, look at all the green hearts. Anissa, I feel you. I feel you. My heart goes out. But it may be time for us to shut it down. I know what I'm going to go do. I'm going to go find this imposter me and try to catch him. But that's going to be like catching lightning in a bottle, because I'm quick. Hey. Uh, and the fake me is quick, too. But I'm going to try to find him. Oh, I'm going to find him. So just be on the lookout for the uh, the other version. And the video that I took with him coming in and interrupting all my... That should be posted soon. Um, it, was a, it was a large file. <laughs> so just be patient. But it's coming. It's coming. It's 3.30... Am I spoiling something? Now, is that the is that the Matchbox 20 song? It's 3 a.m. and it must be raining. Is that what you're referring to? Because I loved Matchbox 20 back in the day. Um, let's see what else, what else, what else, what else. April's too far away. I know, but that's what I'm saying. I will help you out with these photos. And I got to get everybody on board because not everybody likes a picture taken. You know what I mean? You got to like, you got to like, go, may I please? Yeah. Or just catch them when they not least expect it. Anyway, all right, you guys, before you go, should you should know that I love you very much. And I'm going to say the same thing to you. Before I go, you should know that I love you very, very much from the bottle, bottom, from the bottle, from the bottom of my heart. I love you guys. Thank you so much for tuning in today. Thank you for joining me on this quest, this, this Facebook Live that we're doing. I, I, I wish I could give you more information. Like, I really, really do. But, like, if it was... If the show was already airing and there was, like, some stuff that you'd... Like, some teasers already given out, I could give so much more away. But because the Season 3, Episode 1 hasn't even aired yet, if I... If I... If I tease it out, man. Yeah. I just got this right now. I just got that sign right now. But it was a real soul sword that went... So I can't. I can't. I'm sorry, though. I really am, because I really want to share. And I have some really cool stuff to tell you guys. But you just got to wait till April. 
That's how it goes. Sometimes it's not fair. But you know what? It's worth the wait. Trust me. Trust me. Trust me. It's going to blow your minds. Whew. Whew. What I saw today. Ooh. 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 Anyway. All right. I love you all. It was a pleasure for having me on this Facebook Live. Thank you for having me. I really enjoyed having this great chat. I will say a couple things that really need to be said real quick before I go. Peanut butter ginger chews, cream cheese, cheesecake. And tell Kat to stop baking things for me. But if she wants to bake something, she can bake the second thing that I said, and she can give me the peanut butter ginger chews. So, am I selfish? Maybe. Am I hungry? Definitely. All right, you guys. It's been real. It's been fun. It's been real fun. I love you all. And good night.